OK, let's show you a really quick way to hide a pupil's face in a photograph using an emoji. When you've got a photograph of the pupil you want to use, tap onto Edit in the top corner, and then press the three little dots and choose Markup. Normally here you can use the pencil tools and the highlighter to colour in your image or to add annotations, but if you press the plus button at the bottom, you can choose Text. Double tap on your new text box, and then you can choose to add an emoji. I tend to go for an emoji that kind of mirrors the expression of the child in the picture, and then tap on it to add. From here you can use the font menu to make the size bigger by dragging that slider all the way up. Try and match it to the size of the head for a better result. Then you can just drag it across your page, use two fingers to rotate, and position it exactly where you want it to be. Press done in the top corner when you've finished, and your photograph will now be saved with that emoji on the child's face. Much better for safeguarding, much better for online privacy, and now it might be an image that's safe to share, if your school will allow it. Hey, thanks for watching that video. Now, if you enjoyed that and you want to find some more quick tips for your iPad or to use in your classroom, do me a favour and press the subscribe button down below. That will really help me out, and it will help you keep up to date with all the latest tips and tricks on my YouTube channel.